Greetings and salutations everyone. Welcome back to more Ox Must Die. Previously we completed the show quite a hand of a go cast stream, did a bit better but you know did what I've on it. But I shown the flame voice which is my favourite weapon in the game. This time we're going to the arena. And this gives us a brand new roof trap being the pounder. So now the order sent yeah. me to the fortress. As you guys can see this True to his name, region, a big open area and with two whiffs so to wait for the pickin'. But we start with 7,000 gold. Nice. As for the way through this stage, you can kind of go with whatever you want, but I am still going to go with the we knowledge leader, Stand as strong. I want the extra gold. We're going to grab our flame braces and an absolute necessity is barricades. Anyways, I'm going to go for a particular rift in general so you can completely close off one and focus on the other. Other than that, well the reason they give you the pounder is for this. They want you to get enemies to go in here and the pounder can hit them in the roof which is pretty good. I'm not going to lie. So we're going to go with it. There's some other traps, well, we can go with some wall traps. We can grab this, we're going to grab an archer. This level, we've got basically the main four. So, if you want to block off enemies, you want this particular setup. <laughs> But you want to make sure that they do not go from one door straight to the other. So the recommendation is to make it so they go all the way around. So we need to walk off this bit next. This will be good. Basically go for a free barricade setup on this area and then block off this bit because then enemies that come out here, they're not gonna give a shit. Like once another ba once another by up, they're just gonna go right over here and they're just gonna How is that opening tab? I don't know why that's opening tab, I'm not even pressing shift tab. That's gonna move with me later on, isn't it? Oh, shoot. I was trying to figure out what the issue was, but Oh yeah, orcs now have shields for this. You can see what they want you to do. It's not too bad a setup that they want you to do. You've got to really protect one side, like get it set up instantly. Because there's a stage where you can lose an enemy to a rift in just wave one if you're not efficient in your setup. As you can tell, I really was not. They have the pounders. Well, they're actually kind of an insta kill trap. I recommend the spell weave because more gold from enemies is great. You can use the trap okay, one. I I didn't imagine that. Definitely a woman's voice. But it's still tricky to do that regardless because you have to rely on your traps to kill enemies. That's why I prefer the weave that the weaves that I chose because well my playstyle sort of supports them more. Be being in the fray and all that. In your face. Now in order to this? get another setup all done efficiently, well good. we kinda have that sorted. All you have to do is block off one of the whiffs entirely with a bunch of barricades and we're sorted. Of course, tar traps are always a recommendation. Yes. Do I have ton of group? Whiff sentience is great as well. Like, I recommend getting that. Like just ASAP, which I'm actually going to focus on right now. Be careful out there. 
room. So do that. So we should set that up right here. Could you get some pounders and tar traps set up like that? That's also not going to work. Huh. This we're gonna barricade okay there because we're gonna need one there later on anyways. In the enemy's area is still going to be a bit weird, but you can see how far the rift will go with lightning. So right now we're in a really good position. So this stage is also, I would say the most difficult on hard mode. Okay, enemies have destroyed barricades in like two hits. And they will rush. Like, they will absolutely rush for you. This looks like some kobolds are coming? They're just archers. And yeah, let's go for a bit of a sniper duel. Yeah, these guys now have shields. Basically, you need to damage them enough to get rid of their shield. But flame braces ignore that entirely. As you can guess. That's why I love them so much. Because if the enemy is on fire, they will drop their shield. That's making them mega walks. Yes. So we got Das set up. So now we want to go for a bit of a rushing strategy. What do I mean by that? I mean, we want to go to this door, place down a flame wall. Get over here and do our uh, snipe duels to these guys. The way it's gonna work, they're gonna be hit by a power trap, potentially die. If they don't, the rift will kill them. They don't attack or something. Oh no! They shouldn't be destroying barricades! Why are they destroying barricades? They shouldn't have been destroying them. What have you got? We That's serve really the Fight well, Warmaid. Yeah, it was basically a loss on that stage. I'll do this. That. That. So. Now the order sent me to the fortresses on the western line. So why is it it's a dangerous region. Ah, uh, the reason it's is because that was danger. blocked off. That's the problem. The They're just so cute. Funny. Yeah, because we weren't destroying the barricades before. The reason they were going for this one now, the reason we destroyed those barricades is because the only way they could have gotten there is the fastest we would have been through here. Then those barricades. So don't do what I did. Something for your face. Uh, let's see. This. Right this. There. That's a spot. This. I can go there actually. And. Could place a couple of these down. I guess there's really no harm in placing them down. Why did I not do it on fire? It must have been an immunity phase or something. Need this bit covered next, which I can't even do. Ugh. I know I didn't imagine 
Yeah, so you can't exactly block off a weft, but that's okay. They'll like this one. So I know that we can just go for sort of a bit more of a basic stuff, I guess you can call it. But it means we're defending two us at the same time, anyways. We get more money for the to actually with the with what I'm thinking of right now, so that's all good. Um Basically we want Ooh, here's a good one. Actually you know what? We should go for a weave. Stand strong. Then uh This should be alright. Yeah, I'm hoping to set up that I'm thinking of World War. To find out in due time. Of course, getting a ton of art on the stage is always a good thing. The end game of this is to get a bunch of art, just to cover one entire side, and that's probably what I'll do at the end of this wave. Bye bye, evil guys! Just want to make sure that this part is completely covered. Which it nearly is. Couple more of these. Couple more barriers. And we'll be well sorted. This should do. So let us get all these going. Yeah, I think it's just archers at that point. I'm hoping so. I need to keep an eye on the map and just make sure they're not destroying anything. Give me a block of the entirely is what causes them to just attack to begin with. Because obviously, you can't just block off the win. If you do, they have no way of actually gain to us. They have to destroy the battle. It's a battle cave. You don't have to block off a win entirely. It means that they have to take the long way around. But I can still block off of it in its sort of sense. Uh, at this point. Well, I guess I could demonstrate. This won't hurt a bit. I don't have to block the rift entirely. In fact, I could take it just a little bit of a step. In a different direction. Or the other other white meat. Okay, I can have a bunch of barricades here. Do we can say enemies will have to take a bit of a meandering route? Did you see the route is gonna zap it's gonna zap them and they're gonna have to go this way. So if I were to do this then yeah, you know, they have to go through a tar trap, keep gaze zapped. I could get a couple arches behind the rift. And I'll do. Look at the map. Oh, my God. 
just yeah, with the archers combined, are just gonna do some damage. Good times, good times. Here we go. There's our combo shooter. Quite lovely. So if I get a barricade here and here and here. Hold up for this. Yeah, they've got a lot they gotta do just to get to one whiff. Let alone a second. So it should be good. Good time. Good time. I'm not gonna expect to do a stage perfectly. I only restarted because well I pretty much lost. I had too many enemies to make it through on that one wave, so that's why we started. <laughs> yeah, we played through them way pretty easily now. We are going to now just lock down bunch of archers. Oh, there's an ogre. There's something to worry about, but he's taking constant damage now, so that's all good. The ogre is a bit of a main priority, but I can't go for him just yet while there's a ton of enemies. There you go, he got killed by a trap. All I have to do is just get a flame barrier out and boom. Here comes our combos. Now, I want to take things off just a bit of a step further. I could do this. The other, other white meat. Oh yeah. And we can get some spell weaves. This will help. Just to have traps get charged up quicker. And we go. This is quite a fun stage to master, especially in this sort of setup. I think it's, there is an endless version of Ultimus Die 2 where it's literally just a stage. It could be one of the returning stages though. I've not done the returning stages in Ultimus Die 2 yet because... But I haven't even cleared Ultimus Die 2 yet. I probably will after this playthrough but I have to do it on easy than normal but I might just do it on easy thinking about it. So he's attacking a barricade. In the face. Oh, I don't know what was attacking the barricade. I'm worried that whatever it was is going to be a bit more dangerous. But there you go. That's it just done with well, no issues. Let me just see the level of down close. That was the arena. So next time is the balcony. I will see you guys for that.